Hello everybody, this is Stranger Gamer back for an, for the next two matchups of the Secret Showdown Tournament. And well, you'll see we played who when I enter the codes. Oh, Alright, we're back for our first matchup, which is the Apatosaurus, lethal type, facing off against the revival type Deinonychus. And speaking of Apatosaurus, in the red corner we have the Apatosaurus. With a move set of power drain, arc discharge, and um, forgot what his other move is. Where is his other move? That is in the description below. Anyway, in the blue corner we have the Deinonychus. As I just said, revival time. With a move set of dynamic galaxy, tappy jar dive, and struffio rush. This could be an interesting match. And I'm quite looking forward to this one because, well, get to see a Patasaurus straight as stuff. Which we don't, again, as I think I mentioned before, we don't really see it often. And hopefully we'll get to see some secret moves. Oh, we got the power drain. Spam the buttons! Oh wow, I did loads of damage. I did a decent amount of damage there, didn't I? Ooh, we got Dynamic Galaxy triggered. Ah, oh, I didn't get it off. But it'll still be there, so it doesn't matter. The Apatosaurus on top so far. Ooh, the Apatosaurus gets off another head. Ah, oh, triple head, but that's the one. I think this is lethal for Deinonychus. Yep, that is game over. For, well, it's not game over for the Deinonychus, but that is the first. That is a first round win for the Apatosaurus. Pretty, pretty dominant there. Well, on to the second, on to round two. Right, on to round two. And well, we know the combatants. Hopefully, will we? Hopefully, we'll get to see a secret move this time. Although, it's not as likely because there's only two present at the minute. <laughs> Originally, I was just going to have them all have... I was just going to have the movesets be all the secret moves. Ooh, Dynamic Galaxy right away, nice. But I thought, oh, that's, a bit, that's a bit too boring then. So I thought, vary the moveset. Ooh, the Deinonychus gets his first hit. That's Tappy Jara and Strufio Mimus comes in to add extra damage. Slip, slap, slip, 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 and kick. A good, wow! I took half his health. A strong start from the Deinonychus, and it needed one. Ooh, dynamic galaxy is about to activate. I think this might be curtains for a Patasaurus. Push, push. That is going to be curtains as the Struthiomimus finishes him off. Wow. <laughs> that was quick, wasn't it? And the Deinonychus dominates round two and evens the score. You know what that means? It's going to all come down to the next round. Well, let's hope for a more close match this time. I mean, the first two ma round matches were a bit one-sided. Well, the first one in, the fa in favour of Apatosaurus and the second one in favour of Deinonychus. And hopefully, maybe, we'll get to see Arc Discharge. Because I think, as I mentioned it before, you just don't see a Apatosaurus that often. Secret to Kuyo! Yeah, both of these seem to have high damage output, so... That probably explains why we've been having quick matches. Ooh, we have a tie. Ooh, a crit hit from the Apatosaurus. Yeah, look, yeah, look at the damage there. Apatosaurus must has really high damage, and that's not good for the Deinonychus. Ooh, but the Dynamic Galaxy might help it out. Well, if it gets it off. Ooh, Arc Discharge has been triggered. 
Ooh, wow, it's a tie. <laughs> On another tie! Wow! <laughs> Ooh, we're gonna see Ark Discharge! As the Apatosaurus defeats the Deinonychus! Whoa! Electrocuted to death! <laughs> it floated in the air! And after a multiple and after several ties, the Apatosaurus gets that big Ark Discharge off! and kills the Deinonychus and and the Apatosaurus will advance to the to the quarterfinals well no film was better we got to see dynamic galaxy and we got to see arc discharge so I'm happy with that anyway let's move on to our other match of this video <laughs> I've just realized this match is actually um, a remake of another matchup in the first video and, if you've guessed it, it is the Crowlophosaurus facing off against the Verizinosaurus. However, this Cryo is tie recovery type. With a moveset of Critical Block, Something, and Blizzard Smash. In the blue corner we have Verizinosaurus. This, this one though is the Revival type. With a moveset of Claw Blade. Um, I forgot what they would do. Oh, they'll be in the description below if you want to know. I'm sure I'll remember them when I see them. The winner of this will advance to the quarterfinals to face the Apatosaurus. Hopefully, we'll get to see some secret moves. Oh, we have a tie. Ooh, there's the tie recovery effect of the cryo. Ooh, the Crowlophosaurus gets the first hit. Ah, Tie Bomb, that's the one. And the Velociraptors come in for the critical block. And that's not good for the ferry. And no, neither is that. Okay, so if the ferry gets a 4 or a 1, we're just going to repeat it. Until it gets a 3. Until it gets scissors or paper. And it's a tie. Just like the cryo would have wanted. <laughs> that was close, wasn't it? The cryo is completely on top right now. Dealing a sight. Leaving the fairy's health in the red. Go away. Oh, and that's the fairy dead. Wow, the Crowlophosaurus. Just like the Crowlophosaurus did in the previous video. Dominates against the fairy. Let's move on to round Alright, we're back for round two. Can the fairy even the score, or will the cryo advance to the quarters? Secret to Koyo. Okay, and now I know this moveset. That is, um... Draw me a rush, and that is... Exciting strawberry cake. <laughs> Got there in the end. Will we actually see some secret moves from the cryo? Oh, we start with a tie. And another tie. And another tie. <laughs> a lot of ties this video. Ooh, the cryo gets the first hit as a tie bomb comes in. Wow, I think this is going to be very one-sided. Please don't be scissors. Okay, that's alright, that's alright. The fairy actually gets a hit. Oh, doing a decent amount of damage there. Oh well, at least the fairy got a hit. Before it dies to the cryo. <laughs> wow. Very dominant from the Cryolophosaurus. And it will be the cryo that advances to the set quarters to play the Apatosaurus. Ooh, that could be a tasty match. And that's another one. Well, hope you enjoyed. Actually, let's have a look at let's have a look at the format before we end the video. 
Alright, here's a format. And yes, I was an idiot and forgot to show it last time, but... This will be the matchup for the quarter-final round. The Potosaurus Blunder type facing off against the Cryo, which is Strength type. And then over here we have the Lethal type Apatosaurus facing off against the Tie Recovery type Cryo. Be a good match. And in the next video, we are going to see the Tide type Pachycephalosaurus facing off against the Recovery type Apatosaurus. And we're going to see Eoraptor facing off against Deinonychus. So stay tuned for that, and I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please leave a like, and if you're new, you want to subscribe, feel free to do so. And this is Stranger Gamer signing out. Ba -dum.